Yo guys, what's going on? King Flipper here and welcome to another UCL SBC. Today we are doing the one-shot SBC. Uh, as it says, basically complete this challenge for the way for Champions League players, which gives you a mega pack on tradable. Uh, this SBC, it's a good SBC, but is it worth doing? No, unless you have UCL rare players because they're going through the roof already. Uh, 15 minutes into doing this SBC of, since it's come out, and already UCL players are all over the shop already. Um, other than that, the rest of the requirements aren't too bad. Um, so requirements, you need clubs max of eight. As you can see, I've got seven clubs, so you're all right there. Uh, so you could easily change one of these uh, silver players, just to let you know. Um, players from one club, max of two. Bear that in mind. As you can see, I've got two uh, New York players, uh, two Keel players, and two Hanover players. As I said, you can change them quite easily. Uh, and two Seattle players. So... Easy peasy. Uh, UEFA Champions League rare players, minimum of two. As you can see, I have Ramsey in centre mid and Trippier as a right back. You will need them in specific positions. So you can either go right back or left back and then you can get the silver player for a left right back. It's easy to change. Don't forget this is a method to show you. Uh, team over rate of 77. We are, we're on 77. It's, it, we're easily above it. These players can easily be changed. Don't I don't lo don't know by too much. I don't think you can lower him too much because, as you can see, we've only got two players above 78, um, uh, 77, 278 players. The rest are 76s, so just bear that in mind. Uh, team chemistry of 85. We're bang on 85. That's the reason why I said you need a centre mid and a right mid in them positions, otherwise your chemistry won't happen. And 11 players in squad. As I said, I've tried to put as many silver players in as possible. Um... Not too many, just in case these were too high, too low rated. So we'll start from. So Zila, German League Two, five hundred coins bid. I think I might have slightly overpay for him, but you know, from Hanover ninety six. Uh, Trippier, as I said, he's from the Atletico Madrid, three k. So how much you're looking for at the moment for UCL rare, rare players? You're looking between two and a half to three and a half k. Uh, I picked him up at three k as a bid, so weren't too bad. As I said, fifteen minutes in, so these should come down, but. There is another UCL, there's a UCL market matchups, which is ridiculously overpriced as well. Uh, Feska from Kiel and Schmidt from Kiel, both 150 coins, both centre backs, really easy to get hold of. Horn is from Hanover 96. As I said, you don't need him, but you can as long you can either have a left back or a right back. Uh, depends on where your UCL rares going, so easy peasy. Uh, Ramsey from obviously uh, Juventus from the Italian league, again 2.9k, 83 rated, so you can see roughly. I'd go 80 rated or higher for the UCL rares because they're all roughly around the same price anyhow you know, at the moment. So the higher the bear, so it means you can get away with lower rate players. Then we get to the MLS. We start off with Ring. I picked him up for 400 coins bid. I probably overpaid uh, from New York City. He does obviously strong link with the other player in a minute. Higuain, 76 rated cam. Uh, Argentinian, again, uh, from DC United. He does soft link with Morales. Uh, who's Argentinian again, 400 coins bid. New York City again, so obviously he links with the ring. Uh, Ladario, I paid, I overpaid, I paid 500 coins bid, but he is a 78 rated cam. Does play for us at Seattle Sanders, who obviously strong links with Rua Diaz, again from Seattle Sanders, uh, Sanders, 400 coins bid, striker. Um, so if it wasn't for these UCL, if the UCL players, this would be cheap. It's 8 point, uh, just under 9k, it's cost me to do this SBC. The, like half of the price is literally well it's more than half of the price is literally them it's ridiculous these this these next year EA needs to sort the way they're doing these UCL these UCL SBCs so you know it's not worth 9k for an untradable mega pack unfortunately because 90% of the time you're not going to get enough out of it at all um, considering you can get tradable SBCs for like 4 to 5k and they're better than this so it's UCL for you, unfortunately. The UCL players are ridiculous. I don't know why they just didn't put one in there again. Because it's an untradeable mega pack. I mean, I've got nothing. It's not even a board. See what I mean? It's not, it's not worth it. It's generally not worth it. Unless you have UCL players, the rest of it's cheap to do. And this is what I mean. Unless it, unless you have UCL players, the rest of it's cheap to do. So, Calgary. He's literally probably the most expensive player there as well. So, no. Uh, but there we go. SBC all done for you. Um, let me know in the comments below if, if you're packing, if you're decent. I'd advise saving packs now because uh, most people are reckoning it's going to be the Prem anyhow. Um, coming out on Friday. So, 
if this was my main account I'd be stacking the packs but this is my SBC account so but if you did enjoy the video and hopefully I'll save you some time and money so feel free to drop a thumbs up it does help the channel or video obviously if you want to see more SBC methods like this though guys don't forget to hit that subscribe button make sure you have that notification bell on so you can keep up to date as soon as I upload these but other than that thank you very much for watching I'll see you in the next video stream take it easy and obviously peace